His video has had over 1 million hits online. He's an unsigned artist. Grime music is his bread and butter. This is Birmingham's JK and it all started here in Sara Park in Small Heath. I started clashing here. I started writing lyrics in the flats just to have a bit of shouter in the rain when we was kids. I used to do loads of things like that. I used to, like, everything builds from here for me. Try my best, but you know more money brings more stress. JK's lyrics are inspired by his life experiences, and it's this which appeals to his fans. It's anyone who gets the understandings of not having the finer things in life when you're young and actually going through a struggle. And that doesn't mean necessarily like poverty or anything, but there's a struggle. Every day is a struggle for people like me. But music was put on a hold after one of his friends and fellow artist Joshua Ribeira, also known as Depsman, was murdered in 2013. I started drinking and being a nuisance, ended up going to jail, had a fight, went to jail. My break from music kind of started from then, from when I got out. Dropped one, two things, but never had the love for it no more. And so it kind of took me away from music for a bit. But then, yeah, like I fixed up basically. And then I just carried on doing what I need to be doing. Despite not being signed to a label, JK is determined to make a living out of grime music. I drop videos, I get shows, I sell my songs. Spotify and iTunes and things like that have streaming things and they pay you. Although the grime scene has seen mainstream success with the likes of Birmingham's Lady Leisha, JK is one artist who aspires to make it big, but in his own way. Satnam Rana, BBC Midlands Today, Birmingham.